Hey, what's up, guys? Six Sable here, and uh, today I'm bringing you guys an 81 and 4 domination gameplay on the map Meltdown. And uh, today, I'm happy to say I'm finally doing a commentary again. Uh, obviously, I've been talking in a few of my past recent videos, but I've, I haven't done a legit commentary over full gameplay in uh, some time. So uh, it's nice to be back doing that. Uh, I've been busy. I always say that, but uh, it's true. But uh, let's just talk real quickly about my class setup, and I have a few other things I want to talk about in this eight-minute video. So um, first things first, I'm using the MSR. It's an assault rifle. Uh, not a lot of people use. It's one of the first ones you unlock, so it's not. I'm not I don't want to say it's one of the worst assault rifles, but it does compared to like the other ones, it isn't too good. But uh, obviously, it's better than like the SMR or something like that. But uh, that's what I'm using. I think it works well. And uh, I'm using quick draw on this and uh, for my oh also one thing I want to talk about a lot in this gameplay is my score streaks and uh, one score streak that I believe is the most underrated one in the game and you're gonna see it in this gameplay that uh, a lot of my kills come from this baby right here the warthog this thing is incredible I rarely see people use it and uh, Whenever people uh, use it, they do extremely well. Uh, obviously, on the bigger maps, it's going to do incredible, like, turbine. I think it's called Turbine. It's that big map. It kind of looks like Afghan. But, uh, yeah. And also, I'm using UAV. I just recently prestige. Woo! And uh, it's, <laughs> I, I uh, don't know what made me prestige. I guess it was just the thought, like... You know, I've always been that guy that prestiges. I never stop on a prestige unless I made like a new account or something. That doesn't really count. But this game, I don't know what happened. I just decided that I didn't want to prestige. And uh, finally, I got myself to do it. And right here, I'm speeding up the gameplay uh, at least till halftime because after this, it gets really boring. It gets really slow paced. I actually only get 29 kills in the first round after a 20 no start. So uh, the first round. Uh, went downhill for me actually and uh, it's probably one uh, I got three of my deaths in this first round out of my four and uh, also I had my teammate which is who I'm gonna be talking about later in this commentary uh, he he really made this game possible let's just say that uh, considering I play alone all the time and uh, I obviously hop into ground war games you know how those go uh, you join ground war games constantly and you're just up against these squads not necessarily squads every time but just teams that are just a murkin on you and it's just bullshit and i get so mad and it's hard for swearing but honestly i go like i'll go on streaks when i'll go like 15 games in a row without a win not even joking uh mostly because i join games and there's like swarms up in the air i'm not gonna fucking stay in that i'm gonna leave like come on now it's not fair it's not cool and i'm not that's that's how call of duty's been all over like all the years but still it gets frustrating and unless you have a squad it for someone playing solo it's really rough sometimes so uh for these commentators that you see playing ground war or just all their gameplay solo i really respect that and uh, that's why i decided to uh play solo back about a year or so two years ago actually i started playing solo and I just thought like people would respect the gameplay more. I'm not saying I've been making videos for two years, but I started thinking about it about two years ago. And uh, yeah, yeah, I guess you catch my drift here. So uh, playing solo is more respectable, at least in my eyes, my opinion. And uh, for my secondary, I think I'm using the B23R. Uh, this gameplay is a couple days old, and I've I've been busy with school and uh, track, so uh, I really don't. I didn't have time to uh, do this. And also, it was my birthday, so, uh, yeah, I had a party and shit, but I'm not going to go into detail with that. I'm just telling you, I haven't had the time, and I, when I do have the time, I'm just tired beyond belief. So, that's my life. Very fun, as you can tell. Very fun. And also, the lightning strike, you throw that bad boy in there. It's a nice, easy score streak to get, and it does you well. And, uh... Oh, yes, yes, we are in the second round right now. I almost forgot. I was just about to say we're still in the first round, but uh, I just had, like, a little brain fart there. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. All right, so this round, it, it does have these times when it gets slow-paced again. And I'm not sure if I speed up another part, but uh, it does get really hectic. I get 
tons of kills. I get tons of these. Wait till you see me get this Warthog. This thing is incredible. I want to talk about this real quick. And there was one thing I wanted to talk about. And there's three minutes left, but I'm still going to talk about it. But uh, first of all, the Warthog. I don't know if I addressed this earlier because I kind of forgot. I've been talking for like five minutes. But the Warthog, it runs through. You guys know how the Warthog works. It just like goes through the map like three or four times, something like that. And it just like drops like stealth bomb or shit all over the place. And it just really goes hard and i'm pretty sure i just talked about that so now i feel like an idiot and uh yeah so here's my warthog watch the bottom left corner of the screen and i'm gonna begin talking about the one thing that i said i was gonna talk about earlier and forgot and now i only have like two minutes left to talk about it and that is teammates teammates are incredibly important uh this guy that i was playing with he did oh right here he's a fail look at this there's my fourth death Hell, that's just horrible. I could have gotten 90 or maybe even 100 kills because I was in their spawn. But uh, anyway, this teammate guy, he was really cool. Uh, I don't have my mic in, but he was like yelling for me. He's like, thank you for being a good teammate. And I actually sent the same message to him uh, right before he sent it to me. So like we sent it at the same time without like realizing it. But uh, this guy was really cool. And uh, he was getting swarms. He was giving me support. And uh, I was loving him. But uh, anyway teammates are so important and uh unfortunately this guy got more score than me in this game that would have been uh, i meant a little better if i would have just come on top on the team but uh, i had more kills so i'm like you know what i'm gonna upload it this guy was good and uh, all that jazz but so if you just have one good teammate it really does make the difference because these people, all you really need is one teammate getting score streaks for you or watching your back or watching the flank. And that can mean the difference between you getting a swarm or some good score streak or you dying five times in a row from being trapped in the spawn. It really can make that big of a difference. Just one teammate. Because this team that I was playing on was not that good. We really weren't. But I had one teammate that was just... He was racking up the kills as well. He was racking up the score. He was doing the same thing I was. And uh, with us both together, we were pretty much unstoppable. And uh, that's why I freaking love having a good teammate every once in a while. And as you can see, he has a swarm in right now. I believe that's his second one of the game, so shout out to him. I might put his name in the description if I remember. But he was a cool dude. Um, I forgot to send him a friend request. And he's... Uh, I don't know. I... I don't really send friend requests, so I'm probably not going to do it because I don't play with anyone anyway. And uh, this game is wrapping up. I hope you enjoyed this little commentary session. And uh, if you found any of these things helpful, I don't know if I gave it really any tips this gameplay. But uh, I do try my best. This I felt like I was more opinion-based in this uh, commentary. But nonetheless, it, I think I did okay. Uh, so I got to run somewhere. Not really run. I gotta go somewhere. But anyway, please like the video and subscribe. All that good stuff. I'll catch you all later.